Hello everyone. Welcome to the Linux Int YouTube channel. In this video, we are gonna talk about Python string replacement using Patron. Any string data can be replaced with another string in Python by using the replace method. But if you want to replace any part of the string by matching a specific pattern, then you have to use a regular expression. It is used to search a specific pattern in a particular string value and the string will be replaced with another string if any match found. Python uses RE module to use regular expressions. Before using the pattern to replace string, you have to know the way to write a regular expression pattern. You can use any string value as a pattern for the exact match, but for the specific search, you have to write the regular expression pattern by using meta characters. This is the list of most used meta characters for writing patterns. So let's discuss each character one by one. So the first character is gonna be full stop. It is used to match any single character except a new line. So when you have to use the single character then you have to use full stop. The second character is caret. It is used to match any character or string at the beginning of the string. So when you have to match any string or character at the beginning then you have to use this sign. All right. The next character is dollar sign. It is used to match any character or string at the end of the string. The other character is plus operator. It is used to match one or more occurrences of the pattern. Similarly, the question mark is used to match zero or one occurrence of the pattern. And uh, next we have the brackets. These brackets are used for grouping patterns. When you have to group a pattern, then you will use these brackets, okay? And uh, the next is the curly brackets. It is used to match based on lower or upper or both lower and upper limits. And uh, these brackets are used to match characters based on the given range. So when you have to specify some range and you have to write some patterns, then you will use these square brackets. Okay. And the next is the pipe sign. It is used to match patterns based on OR logic. When you have to define some logic like OR logic, then you have to use this sign. And this is the last meta character and it is used to define specific characters or non characters or digits or non digits. So these are the most commonly used characters for patterns. These are some common methods to replace a string in Python by using patterns. Like we can replace a string by exact match or we can search and replace string in the beginning. We can search and replace string at the end and similarly we can search and replace the specific part of a string. So to replace a string we use some method of RE module in Python. This is the syntax of the sub method. Here pattern, replace and string are mandatory arguments. If the pattern is matched with any part of the string then it will replace the part by the value of replacing the argument. The other two arguments are optional. So these are the four methods or the points that we are going to discuss in this video one by one. So without any further ado, let's discuss the first point which is replace string by exact match. This is my spider3 IDE for Python. First of all, we have to import the RE module of the Python. So let's import the module import RE. Now define a string and the name of the string is going to be original str which is equal to it is a rainy day okay so in this string we can replace the string by exact match and if you know the exact string value that you want to search in the main string then you can choose the searching string value as pattern in sub method okay so I'm gonna define another string here that is the replace string Okay, so now we have to call the sub method. So right here re dot sub and inside this sub method define the string that you want to replace. For example, if I want to replace this rainy with the sunny, then I will write here rainy and now define the string that you want to replace with that is sunny. And uh, here you have to write the name of the original string where we have to do the changes. Okay, so write here the name of the string that is org str. Now let's print the original and the replace string. Print. 
O R G S T R print R E P S T R so if I run this file from here so you can say that it is a rainy day it is the original string okay and the replace string is it is a sunny day let me just add here it is original string okay and it is replaced string all right so if we again run this program so you can see that it is the original string it is a rainy day okay and the replace string is it is a sunny day so that is how you can replace a string by exact match similarly if i want to replace the day with the night so i have to write here day and i want to replace it with the night so write here night and if i run this program you can see that it is a rainy day and the replace string is it is a rainy night okay so that is how you can replace the string by exact match in python all right our next point of discussion is search and replace string in the beginning so to search and replace a string in the beginning first of all we have to define a string that is org str which is equal to input enter a text so in this line we are basically taking input from the user so whatever the user will enter the beginning of the string will be replaced by another string okay so here we have to define a replace string which is equal to re dot sub so inside these brackets first of all we have to define the pattern and uh, we have seen earlier that when we have to replace a string in the beginning then we have to use the caret sign okay so I'm gonna write here the caret sign now define the pattern because the string will be the alphabets so write here a z and uh, similarly the small a z plus we have entered the plus sign here to deal with more occurrences of the pattern okay now we have to define a string with whom the original string will be replaced so let me just replace the beginning of the string with hello all right and uh, we have to write here the original string okay so now let's print the replace string replaced string which is R-E-P-S-T-R all right so let me just clear the console and if we run this program enter text any text that you want hey welcome to the Linux Saint and the replace string is hello welcome to the Linux Saint so it has basically replaced the beginning of the string with the hello word and uh, similarly we can convert this replace string into the upper letters by using the upper method so if I again run this program hey welcome to the Linux Saint and uh, the replace string is in the upper letters or in the upper form and the string is hello welcome to the Linux Saint so that is how you can search and replace a string in the beginning all right the third and the next point of discussion is search and replace string at the end so let's see how we can do that so when we have to search and replace a string at the end so then instead of this caret sign we have to put the dollar sign at the end so this dollar sign will basically search and replace the string at the end so let me just change this value and uh, let me just write here enter a URL okay so the user will enter a URL and the last part of the URL which is dot com is replaced with the com dot bd okay so replace this hello with com dot bd 
and uh, this is the original string and uh, I'm gonna remove this upper method so if I run this program so enter a URL like www.google.com and the replace string is www.google.com.bd and if you have some digits in your URL so similarly you can cover these digits in this pattern by entering here 0 hyphen 9 okay so if I again run this program and I write here www.linuxhint dot 91 com okay so now you can see that it has replaced a string dot 90 com with the dot com dot bd so that is how you can search and replace the string at the end the next and the final point of discussion is search and replace the specific part of a string so let's see that how we can search and replace the specific part of a string in python i'm gonna define a string of emails here emails is equal to n admin at the rate google.com okay and uh, the second email is n manager at the rate yahoo.com and the third email is nstaff at the rate hotmail.com so this is our string of emails and this is our original string now we have to define the replace string which is equal to re.sub so I'm gonna replace this domain with the Linux hint okay so we have to change this specific part after the at the rate sign so for this purpose we have to write here at the rate sign and now we have to write here a to z and we have to replace all the occurrences or the characters after the at the rate sign therefore we have to put steric here okay and now define the replacing string that is linux hint all right and uh, here write the name of the original string that is emails print this original text and the replace text one by one the original string is emails and the replaced string is repstr all right we have saved this program and now we have to run this program so here you can see that the original string is admin at the rate google.com manager at the rate yahoo.com staff at the rate hotmail.com and the replace string is admin linuxin.com manager linuxin.com and staff linuxin.com so the at the rate sign is missing here so if I put at the rate sign here and uh, now you can see that the replace string is admin at the rate linuxin.com manager at the rate linuxin.com and staff at the rate linuxin.com so that is how you can search and replace the specific part of a string in python so in this video we have seen very common uses of the regular expression patterns for string replacement i hope you have learned that how to use regular expressions and how to replace the strings in python so that's it for this video i hope you found this video useful don't forget to subscribe our channel for more useful videos like this thank you